hello everyone this is everlasting and welcome back to my channel today we're going to be watching mob psycho 100 season 2 episode 7 now last episode we had a falling out happen between um reagan and mob and now reagan's acting all alone in this uh business of his and now i'm wondering what's gonna happen with this because he's currently an hc television show which means everything's being recorded if he does something that makes him uh or rather that exposes him as to become into becoming or rather exposing him exposing him as a scammer then it will leave an evidence so hopefully he managed to think all his decisions true because we do have someone uh, behind him trying to sabotage him with that uh, Esper guy as well. But yeah, I'm really looking forward to this. Let's just start now. A boy was possessed. What? <gasps> oh, Shinra will see Reagan. Yeah. Young man, okay. Ebihara Morizo. <sighs> okay, so he is quite well known. The best of the best. Oh, so he's the Mogami san of this era? A rising star. <laughs> Oh god, his voice. He sounds so nervous. Ah, uh, the dragger. Yeah. <laughs> okay, who is the boy? Securely bound. Oh. Oh, he clearly looks worn out. Reagan Sensei. The game. Oh, okay, did he research? Okay. <sighs> Public exorcism. Who's going first? Huh? <gasps> what are you doing? <laughs> okay. So Jodo will Jodo try to do it now. Okay, what if Jodo does it in one go? This would create such a huge comparison and Reagan would be seen as the lesser one or maybe even a fraud here. Yeah, you've already wasted 30 minutes. <sighs> you shouldn't have. Yeah, you shouldn't have taken it. No, maybe this is something that's going on on the screen that he got. You were able to see the truth. Oh, Regan, a true psychic, and Regan is now a fake psychic. Done. Ah, uh, a child actor. Well, you really. You really were good. Oh god, the humiliation. Where's Reagan? That is a thing. In real life. Uh. 
You're, I mean, it was aired in national television. Will his former co workers actually send some kind of expose? You're a criminal. <gasps> oh god, they even found out his high school photo. Oh, okay. Yep. Oh god, so many social media parodies. Oh, ultimate evil. This is like Mogami san, right? But. Hmm. It's calm. What's he gonna do? Will they agree? They don't believe you. Ugh. They might be vulnerable, but they're not dumb. Oh god, he's being isolated. <laughs> Is that mob watching? Ah, oh. who's this? A viewer? Oh, that's Twitter. Four years. Office worker? Okay. None, probably. Yep. Okay. They did. The Dracker? Yeah. The cursed guy. I don't think so he did. Yep, I don't think he did. Oh! You wrote what? Okay, I'm curious. Ah! Flashback? Mm, I'm curious. <laughs> oh, this, this jerk. Mob is not here. Is he at the conference right now? Okay. Admire. Just like Ritsu. He knows. Will Mob come here? I don't know. Mob's not looking through the screen right now, so. You did. Mob might be in this place right now, watching him in person, live. Oh, okay. Oh. Oh god, he's really trending. 58 something. Will a monster appear out of these negative thoughts? Huh? What's going on? Oh! Mm. An evil spirit? Was created out of the negative thoughts, maybe? Oh, an earthquake! Mm. Oh, will he... It's not. It's either mob or an evil spirit that was created by the negative thoughts. Also, <laughs> I 
の追求は終わりですか<笑>では会見を終了させていただきます I mean why is this happening? Is Dimple doing this? Who? One moment, please. Huh? Okay, so we finally have uh, this conversation that we've been, I mean, I've been wanting um, Reagan and Mob to talk and we did get it at the end of this um, episode and it's nice to know that uh they've kind of reconciled in this one so that's nice uh but it's so the plan of jodo is so how should i say this it's so it's, he's so skimming and i mean i know reagan's not doing a good thing but the thing is he doesn't really take uh money or credit if he actually didn't solve a case that was sent to him right like uh people who thought that they were being bothered by an evil spirit, but was it just actually um taken uh by the stress or maybe the sore muscles that they have? He massages them or try to ease their tension, and then it's considered solved. But he covers it under a guy a gu disguise of a, a spiritual spirit case, and that's why it happens. But it usually gets solved. It's not like uh. Uh, he takes money and then just scams the hell out of people. He's just doing something and he's doing it under a disguise, of course, but it's not like he's doing it because uh, he only gets the money. No, he's actually trying to do something and solving it. But yeah, um, Jodo, I mean, I really hope he gets what he's in for right now because, I mean, he has Asper abilities. That's for sure, but the thing is, he's not exactly a good person. That's why I don't want uh, him. Or, I mean, we haven't seen him yet on his good side, so we don't really see much of him. But I really hope that, at the very least, Gojo... No, no, not Gojo. What where did I get that word? But Go, Jodo. Yeah, yeah, Jodo. Jodo would actually um kind of reflect on what he's doing, like trying to embarrass someone just because of something. I mean, what... Regan did was not exactly bad, right? He just tried to get the spirit out of his body and now he thinks it's offending. Like, I mean, if if Regan, technically Regan saved them all in that place when uh, Mogami-san was uh, possessing the girl, uh, technically Regan was the one who, sa who technically saved them, right? Because without Regan, Mob would not be there and so they w their lives were basically saved by that. <laughs> so hopefully uh Reagan's managed to actually redeem his reputation. I don't know if he'll be able to continue this business, but at the very least, the I think Mob actually did that, right? The one that caused the conference to be that um mm, so at the very least show that there's some kind of spiritual being that uh had been in that place during the conference. Um I'm really uh curious if Mo if Shigeo was actually the one who did it, I have a huge feeling it might be him because he was around that place, so maybe he did it. He did it, maybe. And if so, then... Wow. <laughs> I mean, he didn't take credit for it now, but maybe we'll see in the next episode. I'm really sorry about the noises. Uh, my pet was actually caged because she's kind of in that period of time right now. So we really had to keep him, keep her off the other male pets that we have. So I'm sorry about that. But yeah, um... All in all, this is such a fun episode. It's really, really, uh, this episode really makes me think that the power of internet, the power of broadcasting, just really makes a person's true colors actually show. And also, it really shows how other people actually react to these kind of things. And it's so funny and so hilarious that it's actually like this in real life right when someone's exposed as a fraud we usually do this type of tweets and they tend to trend uh, or on in other or other various social media sites so it's eerily similar to what's happening in real life so it's kind of funny if you think of it that way because they perfectly uh, depicted the way that the society goes right now so it's really nice to see that but yeah um 
I really enjoyed this episode. I hope you guys did as well. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you all next time. Bye, everyone.